Hello there, Snow has hit Sweden, so I thought I can talk about how I got um, into riding electric unicycles. Where did I bought my first one? What was my biggest concerns? What about safety? Uh, what electric unicycle am I riding right now? And some other tips along the way. Let's get right into it. So how does one end up riding electric unicycles, you might ask yourself. I haven't done any extreme sports before, for example downhill, but what piqued my interest was electric scooters. About three years ago, a boy started renting electric scooters in Stockholm, Sweden. So I went into town with two friends. We rented three scooters, went blasting down the street like 30 km an hour. I thought it was a blast and this is where everything started. Approximately two years ago, I bought my own scooter. It was a 9 volt ES3 with like the extra battery on the, on the handlebar, which made it go approximately 28 kilometers an hour when it was fully charged. And I really enjoyed it, so I started commuting to work, which is like 15 kilometers one way. And I really enjoyed the freedom this gave me not relying on public transport. I had seen a couple of electric unicycles on the streets before, but they were going really slow and just like bobbing and weaving in between pedestrians. So I didn't have any experience really. What first piqued my interest was one day when I was sitting on YouTube, I saw this channel Kuji Rolls, where this world was this awesome cool guy uh, riding an electric unicycle and it was like blazing fast. I was very amazed of what he could do on the electric unicycle and my uh, interest uh, started here. So I started googling about electric unicycles, what models are there, how fast are they, what is the range. I found this uh, website called electricunicycle.org uh, which is a great forum where people are uh, discussing a lot of topics around electric unicycles, what to buy, what uh, what to look out for, what gear to buy, etc. After reading up on electric unicycles for a while, I decided that I want one. But then, what should I choose? Uh, I didn't want to invest too much into this hobby, which I didn't know if I'm gonna like or if I'm even gonna be able to ride them thing. So. I found this website called ewheels.se, which I think is the same site as ewheels.com. I found a cheap electric unicycle, the Gotway MCM5, uh, with only 340 watt hours of battery, which is less than the V2 comes with, I think that is 700. Um, but it was on discount, so it only costed 500 euro, and I thought this was uh, okay amount uh, for testing out uh, if this was something for me. So I hit the buy button on the store, uh, a couple of days later my electric unicycle uh, arrived on the e email and I was soaked to try it out. So I went home, opened the box and every instruction whatsoever was in Chinese, so I didn't understand anything. I had to like try to press things and like figure out what the power button is, uh, what are the LEDs telling me, how do I know what my battery status is, so it was a kind of learning curve but I eventually figured it out. So after uh, unboxing the thing, uh, it was time to learn to ride. So how did I learn to ride? First of all, I read that uh, your new shiny thing might get very banged up when you're new in this hobby. You might fall a lot and the UC might get damaged. So I actually bought some bubble wrap to put around the thing, uh, which uh, should hopefully keep it a bit safe from all the hard hits it might withstand when I'm learning. After I done that, I went out on the pavement and I brought on to like a garbage can, which was standing, you know, like these green ones. And I just saw another garbage can a couple of meters down the line and I was like, yes, I'm just gonna go for it and aim for that garbage can. At far first it went um, really bad, like I could go maybe five centimeters and then I fell. Uh, but every time I fell, I actually managed to like catch the wheel. Um, so it didn't actually fell and messed up the whole wheel. After an hour-ish, 
I managed to do this without issues, I managed to start riding just forward without aiming for a garbage can and I also started to like try to turn a little bit uh, and after that it went quite quick to be able to go uh, on a longer ride and turn and all of that. And I could not believe how fun this thing was. I started going out like every evening for like 30 to 40 minutes rides because that's all the battery capacity was enough for and I was enjoying it so much. But let's talk safety for a little bit. As I got more confident, I also started buying more gear. So to begin with, I only had this starter kit you buy for like kids or adults that are gonna do skateboarding. You know, when you have elbow pads, uh, you have wrist, pad, wrist guards and you have knee pads. And these like tiny ones. Uh, but now when I was more comfortable on the wheel and was going like 30 km an hour, which is the max for this particular wheel, I felt it was time for something better. So I invested in a full face um, helmet, which the, one, the ones you have for mountain biking. And I also invested in a motorcycle hoodie uh, with like built in elbow pads, um, back pads. And also the thing is done out of Kevlar, so when you slide on the pavement, you won't get these like nasty uh, wounds. I actually feel safer on my electric unicycle than on my uh, scooter, because the wheel is bigger, so bumps are not as bad. And I also feel that I'm in more control when I don't have a handlebar, that sometimes feels kind of finicky in a scooter, and it's uh, yeah, much nicer controlling the thing with your like leaning and your weight. So as you can see, it's already become dark here in Sweden, it goes really quick now when it's winter, but I hope uh, my story, how I got into unicycles, might help you of deciding if it's the right thing for you. Do you enjoy riding scooters? Do you maybe do extreme sports? I heard people uh, come from that part as well. Then maybe this is a thing for you. And I realized the video is becoming way too long already. So I want to recap, like, uh, what is the main point of my video? So it's like buy something cheap to try out the hobby, so you don't invest too much money into it. Safety is important, read up on your wheel, read about beeps, how they are uh, behaving, how the wheel is behaving, it's very important. And always use a gear, at least a helmet, hopefully more. It's a perfect device to commute on and it's also a perfect device to just have fun on. 50% um, of my rides are commuting, 50% of my rides are just going out having plain fun. So with that I want to wrap up my story here. Um, go out there, buy an electric unicycle, go out and ride, have fun, you will not regret it. And yeah, see you in the next one.